Hundreds of people from all walks of life and of all different faiths have gathered here today in Plaza Alta in Algeciras to pay tribute and condemn last night's horrific attacks. The assailant attacked Diego Valencia, Father Diego Valencia, who died last night of his injuries. The assailant attacked a number of people in this area of Plaza Alta, which houses a number of churches. Among them, another victim, Father Antonio Rodriguez, who continues in critical care. And when tragedy strikes, a community comes together and people from all walks of life and of all different faiths supporting each other. A Gibraltarian couple was just meters away when the incident occurred. They were having dinner at one of the nearby restaurants in the area. They described the incident as harrowing. We heard people screaming, shouting, running into the square, followed by a man who was brandishing a machete. I, I, I was shocked. I, I was numb. I, 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 I thought, this can't be happening. I was incredulous. I couldn't believe what I was seeing. In fear, we didn't know what, what, what this, this man was going to do next. Um, after hitting the victim, he, he carried on brandishing his, his machete and, and he was walking around um, the square shouting and, and, and screaming. When my senses kicked in, I thought somebody needs to call the police. Um, somebody needs to call the emergency services. Somebody needs to call the ambulance. So I helped provide a description of, of the man, of what he was wearing and what he looked like. And, well, we waited for a bit and the emergency services arrived, the police arrived and um, people started to gather around the square and everybody was, was quite shocked and scared. Um, quite a harrowing experience. Algeciras is a multicultural city, just a stone's throw away from Africa. Over the years, its diverse community has strengthened its ties and bonds. A few short months ago, the city's residents came together to celebrate football success. And while there were fears that last night's atrocious events might cause rift and divisions, the scenes today accentuate togetherness and hope.